they're dead. They've been dead for 200 years, so I don't think they're going to really care. But anyway, we get the Titan suit here. I haven't mentioned this yet, but um, it's pretty much a giant mech that you get to walk around in. Personally, I think Ty, the Tasmanian Tiger, ripped off of it. I don't think there's any... Uh, yeah, there is some enemies, of course, with the Titan suit. But on your way to get it, I don't think there is. You know, it's funny. We only use this thing uh, two times in the... No, three times in the entire game. This mission's not that hard because it's really just a standard tutorial mission on it. And it just absolutely rapes enemies. If you ask me, though, I think Ty 2 did rip this off because really, come on. And to get these things off, you just gotta... I just go in any random direction and just punch those grunts. I hate... The, yeah, yeah, dark jack now. You won't see me using them, though, to the final boss. You can pick up stuff. Oh, wait, we need to uh, push that block. Dang it, my side is itchy. Okay, after I do that mission with Vin, I think I'll be done recording, or I may record a little more, because really, I'm a lot farther now than I was when I... Uh, your best bet is just to jump, because if you walk right into it, you can't really guard against this. Guys, there's just really nothing you can do about that attack. You just have to pretty much kind of dodge it to the best of your ability. Okay, I know there's one that we can uh, pick up. Uh, no, I didn't want to get... Well, okay, I guess we can get outside. We can just look around real quick. Okay, we put the block over there. All right. Push. If you didn't know by now, we're going to Samos' hut. Like, we're going to go inside of it. And this is the only time in the game where you can go inside of it. Great, another one of these guys. I wonder how long it'll take them to drain my health. It's so easy to die right here. Well, then again, I guess you could just get out of the Titan suit and kill himself. What the heck? What the heck? What the heck? I, I got stuck. Well, thankfully... Ah, uh, screw it. I'm not risking it. I'm just going to kill this guy with a Vulcan. Where I really... I wish you could strafe. I could take out that guy so easily if I could strafe. There we go, he's dead. Thing is, I think there's some grunts left too, so this thing's gonna die. Alright, well, let's just push this. They bring this mechanic back in Jack 3, but in that one I don't really like it. Yep, I'm dead. Thank God you under... Alright, that was, I uh, was thinking invincibility frames, but I guess not. What the heck, I totally missed every shot. I missed every shot, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I'm killing that guy with a blaster. Come on, Jack. This guy can aim good, that's why I'm not going near him. Crap, I guess I'll have to take out all the baddies on foot first. I can't. What's this? I either lose the Titan suit and die, or... Wait. Nope, 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 nope. That's not going to work. That's not going to work. I was going to long jump. Yeah, I knew I was going to die. There's no point in me trying to avoid it. So now we have to redo this entire segment again. And we just hit an hour in recording. Good thing this mission just doesn't take that long. I just hate having to replay the stupid segments. I really like the idea of being in a mech, but its controls are really weird. Like, I get stuck behind something and I can't get loose. Let get off of me! They just bang on the freaking head of it. There. I wouldn't be this down. I wouldn't have died if I, if for some reason the thing hadn't glitched out on me and I couldn't move. All right, jump, jump. Wait, what am I thinking? I can just use the peacemaker. Back up to get out of the mech. Back up to get out of the mech. I've heard that line so many times before. Get this precursor orb. Yeah, I'm gonna use the peacemaker for the first time. One hit kill is all I need. I should have freaking done that. Why didn't I think of it? I guess I forgot I had the Peacemaker. But at least he's dead and then up here some more. Right? Nope. Not yet. Alright, well... 
We're almost back to where we was. Let's go. Probably get the cut soon. Oh my god, yeah. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna get out. Back up to get out of the back. I've heard that line just so many times. He's dead. Dead. Metalhead Flambe. I think that's what Six says. I don't know. Besides, uh, the next mission uh, doesn't use any uh, ammo, so I'm not really going to worry about it. Wait, I uh, screw him. He can just live because I'm already I'm already going to kill him personally. Oh, boom! Okay, I think this is the last metalhead that we encounter. Come on! It's great. Oh man, that was that's fine. I know you can grab blocks and you got to toss it. I think. Right. I forget what you do. You do something with this stupid thing. What do you do? Oh, I can jump with it. Okay. Let's well, just bunny hop because this thing's moving slower than anything else. And a boom! Ah, uh, wait. I think there's some metal heads behind here. If they are, they're just grunts. They're not really anything to be threatened about. Nope, that's it. No more metalheads. Sweet! Cutscene time. I spent many a day cleaning up this place for old Greeny. Good work, Jack. And Daxter, I suppose. Before we came through the rift long ago, I was nurturing that life seed from the great tree. It seems the metalheads are attracted to its power. Take the seed to Onin now. She will prepare it for Samus. Y you mean you? No, the other me, Daxter. My younger self needs the seed's power to become sagely. So, let me get this straight. It's fair to say that by bringing your younger self the life seed now, we helped you become the sage you are today. We helped you get your powers in the first place. 